Welcome to Power Star Golf. I know what you're thinking. Golf is simple, right? But if you want to be a golfing legend, you need to climb up through the ranks. So you play golf to earn XP and level up. The better you play, the more you earn, and the faster your level increases. Leveling up unlocks new events in the career and exciting new courses to play on. And more. Each course has a resident golfer. Beating them in their marquee career events will unlock them for play. Each has a unique special ability to learn and master, so try them all to find your favorite. You also need to choose a caddy. Each has a unique skill that can help you out in a pinch. You earn credits for every yeah. round you play and every career event you win, which can be spent in the store to get new gear to improve your game. So, if you're ready, let's get started. To aim your shot, use the left stick. The flag indicator shows where the pin is, but aiming straight for it might not always be appropriate. To view the target area, press the Y button. The circled area shows where the ball might stop, but doesn't account for wind or elevation. You'll need to compensate for both when aiming. Try to keep the ball on the fairway, fringe or green, as playing from a poor lie, such as rough or a bunker, can affect your shot significantly. To take a shot, press the A button. As the shot bar fills, press A again to set the power. The triangular marker on the shot bar corresponds with your current aim distance. After setting the power, watch the cursor as it moves back down the bar and press A again when it reaches the center of the strike zone. Timing is crucial. The farther from the center the cursor is, the less accurate your shot. Hit the red areas and you'll hook or slice the ball, sending it curving to the left or right. Miss the strike zone completely and you'll flunk a shot. Take that! Unless you're putting, you can apply spin by using the D-pad while setting up your shot. Use side spin to play curved shots, known as drawing or fading, and top or back spin to control the ball on landing. With irons and wedges, you can change your shot type by pressing the X button. Pitch shots have a steeper and higher trajectory, while chips are very low with a lot of roll. Both can be very useful when approaching the green. Perfect shot! Oh. Woo! I'm raising a ruckus! Great approach! Records are stored for every hole on every course. There are records for the longest drives, closest approaches to the pin, and longest putts. When taking a shot, records are marked on the course, so you can see what you have to do to beat them. Beating a friend's record will earn you XP, as well as bragging rights, and set a new standard for others to beat. The world record is always visible too, and can be beaten like any other, provided you have the skills. Yes, another one for the record book.
When putting, the grid reveals the slopes in the green, helping you estimate where the ball will roll. The faster the dots move, the steeper the ground slopes in that direction. You can change the length of your putt by pressing the X button. To start the putt, press the A button. Then as the shot bar fills, press A again to set the power and play the shot. For par. Mosey on in there now. Huh. Not bad. Not bad. Golfers and caddies have special abilities and skills that can really help your game. Each one is unique and offers distinct advantages when mastered. You can only use them a few times each round, so choose your moments wisely. To activate your golfer's special ability, either hold the X button while setting up the shot or press it while the ball is in motion, depending on the golfer being used. Caddy skills are always activated by holding the B button while setting up the shot. But bear in mind that these have limited uses too. Another one for the record book. Rough landing. Hmm, nice. Seems to be uphill. Coming in close. Pa. You're ready. I sense it. Mosey on That was very good. You can do better. One down. A hundred to go. Challenge. 
Power Star challenges give you the chance to earn extra XP if you can complete them. There are many different challenges, from simple to complex, some decided by a single shot and others lasting for several holes. The more difficult the challenge, the greater the reward. If you don't want to take on a challenge, you can simply ignore it. There's no penalty for failing. But remember, if you pass them up, you'll miss out on that XP. <laughs> Take care. A small breeze is blowing. Oh boy, look at that fly! Never liked bunkers much. This is a tricky lie. Watch for the power reduction. Shh. Take that. Spot on shot. For pa. You're ready. Shh. Ha. Acceptable. Can we do better? 